you can have a nicely made dress but ironing spoils it let me show you how i do my ironing i turn it inside out then i open it flat like this i proceed to i showed you in the other video how to set the iron i'm still using silk then you turn to the other side open it flat Increase the heat slightly because I wasn't seeing the steam. Right. So when you newly put water in your iron, when you just put water in your iron, allow it boil a bit, allow the steam come out. If you don't allow it come out, it can stain your clothes, it can make your dress dirty. So allow the steam to come out, allow it to boil a bit before you continue. And when you are not ironing, please leave it upright. It's not good to leave steam iron facing down. It drips. Leave it up. When you put it up like this, it allows the steam to keep boiling before you need to use it. Next part is the zip part. But usually, I don't leave my clothes on iron till I'm done sewing. I iron as I'm sewing. So when I'm done, I turn it to the other side. I still make sure it's open. Make sure it's open. See, I'm holding it. Open it flat. Okay, see how I turned it? I'm ironing flat. Ironing it like this doesn't make, uh, allows the hips stay flat when you wear it. I don't know if you've seen some dresses some people wear and you will see that the hip is sharp as if it has an ear. That's because it was ironed like this. If you, if you hold the sides and put it down like this. Are you seeing? If you iron the edge like this, it will give you that sharp razor look and you, go, you don't want that. You don't want your cloth looking like that. You want it to look um, easy on you. You want it to like you, I don't even know how to say it, but you don't want it to look sharp, sharp. So you iron the zip, make sure it's open, then you iron, go to the other side, open again, and iron flat. You can see it's flat, and I'm not ironing, I'm not ironing up to this edge. I don't want a gate up. So ironing it flat makes your cloth look very nice. It will not give you a gate or it won't give you a sharp ear, making your hip look funny. So I'm done with the sides. And I go to the hem again. I smoothing down any excess smoothing down but we are done the slits I don't know how you sew your slits but mine I look for the shorter side I put the shorter side up I put the longer side down so this side looks longer than this if you have something like that but if it's equal you can iron any side so you measure the allowance um, from your sewing allowance, that's the same amount you need for your slits. So I fold it down, then I iron and make sure that, I hope you can see what I'm doing. I make sure that when I get here, it enters smoothly into the sewing line. You don't want it looking like it's different from your cloth. Then I open and I iron the other side down. So 